they made it brighter. That's it. They made it brighter. <laughs> Yo, what's up, Tail from Nation? It's me, the Tail from Hunter here again. And hold up, let me adjust the camera real quick. Hopefully, that's better. But um, yeah. Anyway, we're now, as you can see, on the, my background wallpaper. It's Clash Remove the Elite. Yes, I am going to be seeing the Blu-ray changes because I now have the copy. Let me show it to you guys. So as you can see right here, it's on the screen. We have uh, the volume one. I'm going to cover up the volume one for now. So yeah, as you can see on the right, the right side, it's, whoa, there we go, right side on your, on the screen it's the blu-ray edition okay so you're gonna we're gonna have to compare it intel though episode one doesn't have improvements or changes or fixes because i think from yes from what i remember on episode one it's really really good the compositions of the shots they all look cinematic and it was really good so i think and from the the intel that i got episode one had no changes okay so that is why i'm not going to play episode one but i am going to play episode two because there is one change hold up let me backtrack a little bit don't mind the dog though yeah so there is one change and that is the lighting composition one minor scene they literally changed that just for the lighting. But we're going to take a look anyway. We're going to compare it. And then, as you can see on the left uh, the left side of the screen, it's the uh, Crunchyroll edition or the television first version of Season 3. We're not going to watch Episode 1. We're going to watch Episode 2, okay? But I'm going to have to jump to that timestamp so that i won't be making this longer so um yeah and at the same time people were whining about season three as we all know people are whining people are crying fans are crying the light novel fans are crying that clash of the elite season three had uh one of the worst if not the worst adaptations ever and plus the animations art style suck well guess what blue lock do you guys know blue lock not blue box okay not blue box not this one okay blue lock the uh the soccer anime that my friends and other youtubers hype out about you know they really hype it up but i'm not hyped about it and i didn't even watch season one season one was like really good from what i heard but i didn't watch it but the versus u20 season of blue lock was garbage it's a fucking powerpoint slideshow classroom of the elite had those moments but they're not terrible okay like literally action sequences that were iconic in the manga were literally powerpoint slideshows in blue lock okay unlike classroom of the elite when it comes to iconic scenes the budget is there <laughs> So you gotta give credit to Studio Lurch, okay? So imagine that we have a better animation art style for Clash of the Elite. Us fans were eating good but cannot be complimented by the fans. But Blue Lock right now, Blue Lock fans are crying and respectably it's uh, it's uh it's valid <laughs> because i've seen it i'm gonna show you clips And 
then Blue Box, on the other hand, a better blue show of this season of Fall 2024. Blue Box has better animation. And Blue Box is not even super famous uh, as uh, Blue Lock. Okay, Blue Box is not it it is famous but it's not super famous it's not as popular it's not as popular as blue lock so yeah compared to that it's disappointing for blue lock fans so Anyway, let's go. Let's now compare the Blu-ray edition and the original TV version. Okay, so here we go. We're gonna jump right into episode two. Episode one didn't change much, or it didn't change anything at all. So I'm not gonna watch that. All right. But let's go to episode two and we're going to check on almost at the finale of it. So, yeah, we're going to go there and let's start right now. By the way, no subtitle, okay, on the Blu-ray copy, but that's not what we're here for, okay? Yeah, as you can see, there's nothing changed at all. This is where the change happened or the improvement, should I say, happened on the lighting. Yeah, there's literally no changes whatsoever, huh? Damn. Granted, episode 1 and 2 of season 3 was really well done. The adaptation was fast paced, but for me as a light novel reader, it's great. It's good because I'm not really impressed with volume 8, okay? If I can't see the improvements or changes, you guys can check it. I probably will miss something in the future. This isn't the same situation as season 2 where they really need to fix a lot of things, so I'm glad about that. <laughs> So far, nothing, as you can see. Yeah, there's the change. The composition of the lighting. Yeah, on the face. Not on Manabu or Tachibana, but the one behind them. I forgot his name, sorry. Best shot of this uh, episode. <laughs> yeah, nothing changes. Nothing was improved. So that's, that was good. Yeah, see? Nothing really improved except that one scene. Which is crazy. Oh, that's it. <laughs> well, the camera died. Or more like, it errored. So, ah uh, man, this camera. It's too old. Let me uh, check something else. So, it's mostly on episode 4. I have a guide here, okay? So that I know. Wait, so episode 3... Eh? Episode 3 doesn't have any changes. Yeah, episode 3 doesn't have changes. Except one? I'm not gonna play it. Because there's nothing changed. Really. Nothing changed. Nothing improved. I mean, well, we... We, um, mm, we still got the, the V-line of... <laughs> oh, yeah! Nothing improved. Yeah, I mean, up to episode 3, it was all good. I think there is one scene. I cannot find it, though. But there's only one scene again. I'm not gonna play episode three. Nothing has improved drastically. So I'm just gonna show it to you guys. I'm gonna put the um, the, the the photo so that you guys can see it. Boom. And that's it. That's the change on episode three. Like literally that's it. So, <laughs> okay, so yeah um we're gonna jump right into the final episode of volume one crazy this has a lot of changes though lots and lots of changes so brace yourselves yeah there's a lot of changes let's play it hopefully the camera doesn't error again if it does i'm i'm gonna check my obs again we're gonna play the whole episode because there's a lot of changes here. There you go, that's the change. Look at Kay. Her eyes, her facial structure. I'm hyped for season 4, because season 4 will be the peakest of second year. <laughs> Oh, 
Oh wait, that changed. Right? I didn't even notice that earlier because it's only minor change. Oh, they changed it. Yeah, there we go. EK and yeah. Yeah, Hirata flex. <laughs> they didn't even bother changing that. Damn. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, they, yeah, they changed the Koji there. This has improved scenes. I know it does. Oh, yeah, Ryu and, right? Yeah, Nagumo, yeah. Yeah, and this again, yeah, Nagumo. They're improving Nagumo's face. Is that? Yeah, it is. Yeah, they improved it again. Yeah, that is much better. Damn, okay. Yeah, see. Yeah, I do prefer the Blu-ray edition. Yeah. He seems more intimidating in the Blu-ray version, that is. Oh, wait, that changed, right? That was improved. Oh, what? Did they change the lighting there? They did, huh? They changed and they improved. Yeah, they improved the Anakoji again. Yeah, yeah, they <laughs> they changed K there. <laughs> Her mouth. Um. Did that change? Or did that improve? Yeah, that improved. Yeah, that improved, yeah. But was there a change? I think there was. Yeah, there was. I can't even tell that. Anyway, anyway, I think I'll see it in the edit. Oh, yeah, they changed there. Yeah, there is a change there. I think there was a minor. Yeah, it's only minor changes. Huh. The eyes, okay. Yeah, the eyes of K and her lips. Yo! お二人さん、今日はバレンタインだぜ。いや、だ、インプーブ、いや。オッケー、いや、だ、やな感じ。そこもらってるじゃないか。俺は図書館に行く途中で軽井沢の呼び出しに応じただけだ。でメイドイッ
Yeah, they improved the Yanakoji again. Nice. Yeah, they didn't even bother improving each other's eyes there, huh? Oh. Mm. They made it brighter. Huh. That's it. They made it brighter. そうなの。綾野浩二君が直接話したかったのって噂のせいで休んでるんじゃないかって心配してくれたんだよね。ありがとう。これでいい。これでいい。うるせえな。佐藤って小野寺嫌わっちゃう。あ、they <笑> Lackbuster reaction. Oh yeah, they changed him out here earlier as well. When he was looking at Anakoji, I didn't notice. Oh yeah, they improved the Amauchi. That's it for episode 4. Once again, volume 1 of the Blu-ray doesn't have much changes except for episode 4. Episode 4 has the most amount of changes and improvement. Uh, like, they uh, zoomed out Hashimoto more on the K and Koji Hashimoto scene. And yeah, they improved uh, the faces. They changed things, like brightened up the uh, the scene of Ichinose on one particular frame. And then, yeah, that's it. Episode 4 has the most changes, and that's it. Episode 1 has no changes. Episode 2 has one change or improvement, I guess. Then episode 3 only has one improvement as well. And that is when a certain student was walking towards the, the dorm, I think. There's nothing that much changes. There's only one episode that changed a lot. Or episode that improved a lot. That is it for volume one or should i say part one of this comparison of the blu-ray versus the tv version of clash with the elite now i'm going to watch the next one but it's on volume two of the blu-ray but once again i yeah i'm gonna watch the whole thing on episode five but on episode 6, there's only minor changes again. Damn, bro. Yeah, they didn't change much or improve much at all, huh? Anyway, all right. We're going to hop into volume 2. But yeah, that is it for this video. Because I'm, I'm going to divide this into four parts so that the videos won't be as long. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you all enjoyed. This isn't much, so look forward to the Volume 2 comparison on the Blu-ray versus TV version, and then Volume 3 and Volume 4. Volume 3 has a lot of improvements, especially on the Tsukishiro episode, and then um, Volume 2 doesn't have much changes. Episode 8, that is the peak episode of Season 3, did not have any changes or improvement whatsoever so yeah we're gonna hop into volume two thank you guys so much for watching hope you all enjoyed this comparison so yeah anyway peace out